Hello. Oh, I've got monitor on. That's better. Don't want to be listening to myself all day. Well, I was going to play some Urban Assault, but I was struggling with uh, the image file and it being in MDS alcohol 120 file, and that was a rabbit hole I didn't want to bother going down. Um, so, what shall I do? Hmm. <laughs> it's fine. Just uh, it requires tinkering and restarting, and the stream was already going, and I couldn't, wasn't going to shut down the stream to mess around with images this close to uh, to starting. So, for next time, um, I want to play some Demon Star. input what we got joystick setup all right which one is joystick one ah. <laughs> yeah right Trolls. As if they're even working. I was right there, wasn't I? Why did I close it? That all seems good. Ooh. It has just crashed, though. <laughs> if you have working hardware acceleration status, you can set latency zero on Galaxy Drive on Unreal Games and have absolutely minimal sound buffering. Uh, I've never had any problems with the sound. Oh, wow. I had problems with this, though. Look at that. <laughs> Doesn't like you messing with the third party joystick driver when you're uh, when it's interacting with it. That's fun. Fine, I'll just I'll just kill it and start it again. Mm. There we go. Oh, don't tell me it's broke permanently now. <laughs> Why would that be? Hmm. Very peculiar. I think I know what it is. It's to do with the bloody joystick driver. Yeah, because it's not opening. Okay. Time for a restart. <laughs> uh.
Typical. <sighs> oh, while it's rebooting, how is everybody? Having a good uh, holidays, Christmas? Sounds very technical. Oh, bro. Hadn't eaten your sauces yet. We've been having the chili sauce on eggs. It's quite good. Right, now let's do this one thing at a time. There's 98. There's our controller. And then I put analog on and we get all the things, all the buttons are working. Seems to be extra buttons on there. Oh, that's for the hat switch when, or the, the D-pad when they're not a hat. Okay, cool. Uh, brilliant. Okay. Okay. Close. Games. That's always a good sign when the uh, shortcut icons are jank. Mmm. I hate it when it does that. Something to do with the cache, isn't it? Anyway. Oh, I need to change the controls. Triangle is not. This game has vibration, which I find hilarious. Oh, you know what? That's not the worst. Nice. Yeah, it also makes a really good pork marinade with a little bit of, um, you know, whatever you like, a bit of sugar or something, a bit of honey. Or whatever. Right, I'm having cable issues. Where shall I put this? Put the back off over there. Ginormous PlayStation cable. Ugh. Why would you have possibly crashed now? <laughs> oh. Music's still going. No, Numlock's gone. That's so weird. It's like it knows. It works fine all week. Uh, this is the GUD bank um, for the X2. I haven't updated to the Braun bank because I'm lazy and it requires taking the computer apart and plugging it into a USB and stuff. So I don't think it's even the latest version of the... Uh, the mouse is still there. I don't think it's even the latest version of the GUD bank either. I think it's like the 2.01 or something. I am sad. Come on, computer. Oh, well, there you go, then. Yeah, it's a great bank. I... What could have... The only thing I've done since the last time I streamed is I installed the correct chipset drivers which enabled DMA for for sound and, and, and hard disk and CD-ROMs and stuff. And, and it's not a problem with the MIDI because it's still going. <laughs>
So most likely it's probably a problem with DirectX, which happens from time to time after the machines had a crash, especially if it was being used. Just had to reinstall DirectX. <laughs> I shouldn't have these problems though because I'm using a, an SD card uh, IDE to SD adapter like restarting the machine or it crashing shouldn't corrupt files because it's not like it's a crashing disk accessing those files doesn't corrupt them if the machine gets shut down it's their stack files static data or whatever um, so I don't know I know but it's an XDHC card from our, uh, a high definition uh, 1080p film camera you know, the kind that are used to being overwritten constantly, and it hasn't been overwritten constantly. I used it from new. So, it's a class 10 card, right? It should last a bit longer than a year, with barely anything being written to it. But, you know. Play it. I mean, it could also be power strip messing up things, but I have that to keep the refresh rate constant. But whatever. running web server that's probably why constant cache writes right i mean i've had ubuntu kill ssds when we're running servers off of them so i just think servers are just not very good for flash storage uh right let's just have a little dx diag check up yay it's become a troubleshooting stream woo already oh Oh. Hello. Why would you change my background? Mr. DirectX Diagnostics Tool. That's really weird. <laughs> uh, What was it? 32. Oh, let's look at the 24 one. There you go. Wham. Yeah. Okay. What is we got installed? We got eight point two installed, which is eight point one with the network patch. Yes. <laughs> it's like did you hear this sound at eight bits at twenty two gigahertz? You're like Yes, because my ears can tell the difference. Great. I had a, uh, a Samsung Galaxy Note 4 that had the like a, a bad SMD mount flash chip, and if the phone was used or got warm, uh, like got warm after a certain amount of usage, the SMD, the surface mount chip, um, would become have a bad contact with the PCB, which meant as soon as you were using it for a certain amount of time, it would just turn, the, it would crash the phone. And uh, I actually managed to fix it with a heat gun, but at the same time uh, managed to destroy the uh, the LCD panel because I'm fucking useless. So <laughs> the flash chip's fixed. The screen's knackered. I think it's about 30 quid for replacement screen assembly, so one day I'll fix it, but you know. Right, this all seems fine. So um, I could just do reinstall the files to make sure the file integrity is good, but that check should have been enough, I think. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Oh. I did not check the file page. Um. Oh. Beta. Hmm. Beta retail. Why would that not be? Hmm. MFC 40. No idea what that's in charge of. Uh, 
<laughs> well, it does. No, it boots up. It's just the screen's all stripey now because <laughs> of a contact problem with the cable, I think, is knackered because I've had it uh, open and apart so many times. Um, yeah. Lol, your link got deleted. <laughs> Skinner. Right. Should we try that again? Or shall I install DirectX again? Who knows? I mean, the icons are all working correctly now. That's good. Why is it? Mm-hmm. So that's what large full screen mode is, I guess. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that was definitely a sound issue. Did you hear that? What is going on? I mean, there's a chance the hardware's starting to fail. Yeah, look, same position. Mm. What could be failing? Is it an internal? I haven't opened it up in a while. I could have bad caps on something. Who knows? Oh, pff, fuck. That makes me sad. I mean, it's not the most powerful sound card. I probably shouldn't have its acceleration up all the way. Hmm. All right, put it on what's recommended. Full hardware acceleration, good sample rate version. Yeah. Okay. Now, I want DMI on, but I, do I want sync data transfer? Hmm. 
<laughs> Resources are all fine, no conflicts. Okay. I think it might have just been that. Maybe. <laughs> it's pretty great. Fighters launched. Man, I used to know all the patterns off by heart. But it's slipped now. Okay, I think that's fixed the problem. It was the sound audio conversion rate. I shouldn't have put it up. I think I put it up last week. I wonder if that caused problems on the stream. Ah, oh, suicide. Oh dear. Ah! Oh, it's all gone wrong. <laughs> but it's working now. Which is good. homing missiles. Should have got the straightforward ones. Oh. This game is so tightly designed. And all the music's by Bobby Prince as well. Which is uh, the guy who did all the Doom music. Which is crazy to go from doing Doom and Doom 2 to doing this. <laughs> oh! It crashed again. But this time, it's the, the controller's shaking non-stop, so I'm wondering if it's the driver for the controller is not playing nicely with Windows 98. Fun. Ah, <laughs> oh, I thought we had it working. Control is still vibrating. <laughs> it's still going. And it stopped. <laughs> he did indeed.
Now, I've got some options here. I could just unplug this controller and not use it and use a normal joystick or a keyboard. Or I could use an older PlayStation controller USB adapter that I know for a fact its original driver was made for 98 instead of a newer driver, this newer adapter, which has got a, I think it's like a, a ported back driver, which is not quite as uh, good. Seems to be a bit unstable. Oh no, I've got I've got a game port gamepad somewhere. I've got a ancient USB one that's got not got any um force feedback. I think the problem here is that force feedback on on <laughs> Windows ninety eight is maybe a bit much. Um I mean and it's not the most stable driver. Maybe it's because the force setting is too strong and it's drawing too much current through a USB 2 port. Who knows? It's not too bad. My uh, my other half um, sends packages to America all the time. She has an Etsy business, um, and they get there pretty quick. Um, I think the problem is not so much the pandemic, but Christmas. <laughs> that seems to be what affects a uh, post office so you know, the most in Britain, anyway. Don't know about in America. It must be mental people sending like huge packages between states. Like if you've got stuff that's at risk of going to the melt the meltdown place, the gold extractors and whatnot, you know, send me a message. Um Yeah, I have not had a single problem with Royal Mail ever. Ever. Like ever. <laughs> They always arrive on time. You know, you get that that person who moans about it not arriving on a certain day, but they used a second class stamp and posted it on the limit day, and it's like you're just a muppet. Um, but that box that I sent um, sent over for Christmas, um, we did that, and they were like, "This is how much it will cost. Stick it on the scales." It'll arrive tomorrow. Here's your tracking number. <laughs> and it arrived. <laughs> you know. That was great. And that was what, like, on the 21st? We had to send it that late because it had perishables in it. Like, hmm. Stamps are expensive. But then again, have you tried posting anything with anyone else? It's just as expensive, if not more. And plus you get fun drivers who, like, you know, have you seen have you seen them when they're trying to find parcels in the back of their vans? Yeah, I'm not talking about the post office, I'm talking about like Amazon Logistics or uh or um Hermes, depending on your area. Like we're really lucky. Uh, our Hermes drivers are two old ladies that deliver everything together. <laughs> um but I have seen some like some Hermes drivers just, you know, they go in the back of their van and they just kick things out of the way until they find what they're looking for. Um Yes, it's amazing. Who would have thought that would have happened? <laughs> and also, the, the, the competing nature of those businesses also means that they don't provide facilities for their drivers or pay them correctly, which causes them to cut corners wherever they can to hit, hit their targets. H&M, maybe. <laughs> 
Right. I'm going to try it one more time. Because <laughs> I don't learn anything. Should I? Should I? I'm going to... Mm. I'm going to... Yeah. I'm going to unplug this controller. Wait. I don't even need to unplug it. I can just delete it from the controller list. Um, and then we'll see if it still crashes. Because if it doesn't, then it's just a bloody driver for this controller. It's a bad time. And it either needs reinstalling or I need to use a different adapter. Uh, remove. Do you want to remove? Yes. Cannot be removed. Please use the device manager. Alright, fine. I will use device manager. Um, human interface devices? Yeah, there it is. And remove. Yes. And removed. There we go. I shall use my quick shot instead. Options, input, joystick setup. There it is, blam blam. Joystick one. Oh, I wonder if it was something to do with this force feedback profile thing. Who knows? I don't have a clue. Force feedback on early early computers is weird. Like before the um the standardized what would you call it? Uh X input. Whatever it was, you know, with the three sixty controllers. It just seemed to be broken everywhere. Fighters long. Ooh, that's nice and smooth. Okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe. They can survive. We'll let them live. Nice. Right, I think we're... Are we further yet? Or oh, not quite? Oh, this is it.
Okay. We good? Yeah, that's it. That was just that bloody driver. Okay. I'd say this is the first game that's natively worked with the uh, force feedback, I think, I've ever played. On, uh, on 98. Oh, that laser. There we go. Easy peasy. played this game too much. Oh no! Yes, give me the blue. Ah, I used that a bit prematurely, whoops. now, I guess. Oh, I hate these tank things. I thought that was one of those health gems. <laughs> it was a bullet. Oh no. Nope. I do want to give up a life here to blow up so I can get another bomb thing and blow up the uh, pipeline. But it doesn't matter. Yeah. Right, have we not died yet? I feel like we've not died yet. Which is great. I used to play this game all the time with my friend on the internet. <laughs> Back when you could use MSN as like a pairing service. <laughs> Ooh. 
Ah, oh, I didn't want the blue. Mm, I just wanted the laser. Oh well. It's not the end of the world. Nice. It's all coming back to me. Another life, excellent. Ah, oh, so many of them. Whew. Natural arcade board of this. It would be amazing. I would play it. <laughs> Although it costs so much money. Nah. Uh, save me power ups. No. know your pattern. You know what, I bet you somebody has made an arcade board of this. It's such a good game. And there's Secret Missions 1 and 2 as well, which just only improve the game more. I don't know if I've ever completed this single player. I think I've only ever completed it um, with two players. Oh, 
homing missiles are so good on this level. And you just keep firing and they just fire around in circles and then <laughs> swamp stuff. <laughs> Hey Danny! Oh, it's a raid! It's my first ever raid. Wow, 27 people, that's quite a lot. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Yeah, no pressure. <laughs> it's a party. You can pause? <laughs> yeah, I can pause. Ah. But I will resume, shall I? Ah, oh, thanks for the follow! It's very art. <laughs> Nice. How you doing? You all good? You having a good uh, holidays? I'm going to resume now and attempt to read chat while I play this uh, bullet hell game. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Alright, here we go. So, pretty much all I do is try and play retro games on retro hardware and spend about 50% of the time trying to fix it because it's broke. Um, like this morning. So I am very close to 50, yeah. Just a few more. Uh, let's see. I'm on 47 now, thanks to you guys. Oh, no. Oh, no! It's all gone wrong. Eat lasers. I really need a bigger screen so I can, like, look to the left or whatever and see chat nice and big. I'm, it's on my phone currently. Oh, no, mine's everywhere. I can barely see them. Give me that big E. Oh. oh no, I don't have any missiles left. This is going to take a while. Ooh. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I got some missiles though. Ha! I do have no power ups now though. I might have to sponge all of my extra lives for uh, more missiles. Oh. Oh, there's so much going on in chat. I really want to read it. I'm on 48 followers now. Thank you. Hey, we did it. Right, let me catch up on chat real quick. Uh, almost 50. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. Uh, loads of follows. <laughs> yes, this is a genuine Win Winners 98 machine. Um, this is the only 98 machine. Um, I've got an XP machine and a, and a Windows uh, sort of Vista 7 era machine as well. Um, this game is called Demon Star. Um, it's great. Oh yeah, take that dog for a walk. <laughs> Quidditch World Cup. You know what? If I get to 50 followers on this stream, I will do a stream special where I play some crappy Harry Potter games. Because I, I did definitely play the first two, and they weren't awful games. Um, but the Quidditch World Cup, I remember being particularly difficult. So I will get, I will find a copy of that, and I will do a Harry Potter spe <laughs> special, and I will play Quidditch World Cup. How does that sound? I really enjoyed the second one. The first one was pretty good, but the second one they improved it a lot. Um, had a lot more mechanics. And why are we talking about the uh, the 
the, the positive qualities of Harry Potter movie tie-in games. <laughs> Mr. Blobby. I will attempt to get that working as well. I have had some success um, with it running on my Apricot uh, QI, which is a, a, a 48... I think it's a 486DX... No, SX. It's the, the, the crappier one. Um, <laughs> but that, that, I did get it working on there, but the problem is I need to, I need to take this machine, this Apricot machine apart. Um... And uh, and and back up its mega old hard drive. It's like I think it's like a 200 megabyte hard disk, and it's full currently, uh, and it's got all of Sarah's childhood on it. <laughs> so I need to back it up before I uh, start using it for uh, streaming stuff. Yeah, the, all the music's by uh, Robert Prince or Bobby Prince, is known as. Uh, he's the guy who did all the music for Doom. Okay, Dom, take care. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Thanks for showing up. <laughs> 19 viewers. Wow. I think that's the most I've ever had watching at once. Thanks, everyone. Oh, I don't remember this level. But there are red things, and they want to kill me. There we go. Oh, I want that blue missile guy. And that red thing, yes. Oh. I know, me too. That's why I play it every Wednesday. <laughs> uh, there are a whole bunch of these things, Danny, that are multiplayer, that totally still work on modern machines. Um, you should totally guess at some point. You could stream at your end too. And I'd like to set up a uh, Unreal Tournament public match or community match. Um, I know uh, people have definitely been interested in that sort of thing or shown an interest. Boom. Oh my god. <laughs> this isn't the worst bullet hell game I've ever played. I did get quite good at, um... Is it Warning Forever? Should probably play that at some point. Oh! I can't tell what's power-ups and what's bullets. Yeah, definitely have to arrange one. But on UT99, yeah. I'll, uh, shall I arrange it for a, for, for a day that isn't Wednesday? What, what, like a, like a, a Sunday evening or a, or a Friday evening or something. I don't want it to interfere with other people's, uh, like, regular gaming routines, though. If they, like, have raids or whatever, whenever they play. Or work. I don't know how well, well this comes across on the stream, like how good the graphics look, if they look blurry at all or anything, but I'm looking at it on a big old CRT screen and it looks fantastic. Oh no! Got pew pewed. It's Trance! Hey, Trance! Uh, this is Demon Star. Uh, a interesting shmup slash bullet hell game uh, with music by Bobby Prince. Ah, I fell for it again! And again! Mm, it's because of the big cannon in the middle. 
get that one. <laughs> oh no! It's eating up my extra lives. It was my last one. I am a fool. Shoot him in the side bit. Ah! Oh, I used up my continue. No! I lost all my score. No! I'm on 49 followers now. I can't believe it. This is like the biggest jump ever. You know, and this morning I was contemplating whether or not I should do a stream. Like, who's going to watch me stream bullshit games on their holiday time? They'll be uh, sitting in front of the TV feeling bloated or something. But you're all here. The side lasers, yeah. And, and just bosses that dupe you into, like ending up where you don't want to be. If I had more patience, I'd be fine. Oh, uh, uh, uh. I want the red ones giving. Yes. Is there a laugh in the song then? Nope. It's fine. Everyone's got their own way of playing. Oh no! I think this is going to be the end for me on this level. But a really nice feature of this game is uh, once you get to a certain level, you can start at that level. It's like a pistol start or whatever. You have to do. Oh my god, too much! No. What's the eye? I want that. I want that. It's an invul invulnerability shield. Now, I don't remember this song, <laughs> which means I probably didn't get to this level very often. <laughs> oh. oh, an extra life, that's good. Is it boss time? Oh! No! <laughs> Fucking lasers! <laughs> Apologies. Wow, <laughs> going. I got five credits, apparently. Which is a thing. <laughs> Side lasers. <laughs> I mean, if you want to clip that, me complaining about lasers, I will turn it into a sound clip. I mean, we've already got spikes, right? Oh. <laughs> lasers again. Got him. Oh. 
Thanks for raiding, guys. Have a good day, whatever you're doing. Stray bullets. Yes. Oh no! Man, I just got max ammo as well. I do not remember this level. Big blue asteroids. I was going to say the sprite work in this is fantastic. Like, a whole bunch of it has to be pre-rendered 3D, right? With the lighting and stuff. And the big polygons on these asteroids. But I think it's great. Oh, I hope those missiles turn red soon. Thanks, Danny. <laughs> oh. That was a mistake. What is that thing? I'm going to have a spaceship, and it's going to have <laughs> horns <laughs> down the side. Great big white horns. Because I love heavy metal. <laughs> It's my favorite magazine. <laughs> Man. What secrets do you hold? I see your twin side lasers. You start with the lasers, yeah, and then what? And then some some blue snot, yeah, and then some yellow snot. And then side lasers, alright. That's fine. Oh, and then a big... Big arc, alright. Fatal Floor was not having a big middle laser. <laughs> oh, he's flashing red. Got him. These backgrounds are beautiful as well. Uh, you can be player two. <laughs> I, it, it works on the internet with the direct IP. If you really want, if you've got the time right now, I think I have this backed up on Google Drive. I could just send you a link. Uh, you decide. I like that every level is different. Like, the aesthetic of the levels are different.
Gobble, gobble, gobble. Oh, so much blue snot. Get away from me! What is going on? <laughs> it's some kind of auto aiming P stream. <laughs> Interesting. And I'm invulnerable. Barely any health, and the boss just seems to be loads of ocean boobs. Oh no, look at him hiding under there. Do your worst. I've got missiles. Ah! I don't see any blue blue lasers yet. Side lasers. Blech. Okay. Just keep moving. Yep. Keep your distance. I hope it doesn't have multiple stages, you know, where it comes out of the water and has loads of side lasers. <laughs> oh. Oh, I've got a pattern down, I think. I could probably, like, skip up the middle of those, but I feel like that second layer of blue shooties. This is what will get you. Yeah. Maybe. Not sure. Ah. Is he flashing yet? No, not yet. Oh, no. Now he's flashing. Okay. Yeah. Test out UT99? Definitely. I could play it on this and give it myself a serious disadvantage playing it on a in glide on a on a 450 megahertz <laughs> AMD K6. Or I could play it on my XP machine, which probably be would, would be better. <laughs> nice. Ooh, the side pewers. Eat my side pews. <laughs> Pretty powerful. 
Nom nom nom. Oh no, I got cocky. Oh. Mistakes were made. Terrible mistakes. I really want that blue. I got it. Nice. Oh, I got the P stream back. Oh, that's so fast. So many bullets. Whew. Close. Oh, hey, Benny. How's it going? Are you having a good Christmas? I saw your tiny little Christmas tree. I thought that was quite funny. What have you been up to? You guys are still playing WoW? Oh no! That thing takes ages to explode. I did not realize. What a waste. Oh, I had I had blue pews and everything. This guy, what does he shoot? Just a load of bullet hell. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Yep. You do that. I'm just keep gonna go bottom left. My last life. Oof. Let me pause. Let me catch up with the chat. Yeah, 15 views. I got uh, Sperry Art graded me with like 27 people. Uh, I'm on 49 followers now. <laughs> You're going to be the only one left at where you work. I see. Yeah, you will be. <laughs> you got a working cooker on the evening before. Oh, no. Yeah, it sounds like everything's getting pretty shaken up there. It's almost like... Having a terrible work environment makes people leave. Then again, I don't know firsthand what it's really like. Spiky, right. 
So I think the theme of this level is big spikes. Yeah. Oh no. I'm taking hits everywhere. Although, I don't know how many credits I've got left. There's like four credits left. Four credits, yeah. I mean, I wonder if one credit champ has done this game. I would love to see somebody do this in one life. God, it's a tank. chat's still moving. I need to read it. No. Ah, work stuff. Okay. Oh no! Fine. It's getting harder and harder. Three credits left. I'm back in space. Level 11.
my god, these turrets are so strong. It's a peace ring gun again. Okay. Fair enough. Invulnerability! <laughs> Kamikaze! I feel like I'm starting to get cross-eyed. <laughs> I hope you don't have lasers. Oh, I see side lasers. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's got side lasers and a great big Gatling cannon. I have to hang out between the Gatling cannon and the laser? No, laser's really wide. Wide laser. close. No. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. <laughs> Damn side lasers. How many levels there are. And I'm running out of credits. Hello! Oh, I'm dead. Ah, oh, thank you, Mr. Valentine. How are you? <laughs> that you're my. Well, I would have thought you'd be my 50th follower. 
But uh, it still says 49 on the dashboard, so who knows. <laughs> I'll need to check manually. But thank you very much. I hope Danny's not driving you spare over Christmas. Too many suicide ships in this level. So many targets. Oh, Mount Misses. Give me the homing ones. Nope. Ah! side lasers. Ah, ah, ah. Oh no! They're hidden under flaps! <laughs> no, I've died. <laughs> Thank you, Steve Tech Gaming, <laughs> for the follow. So many followers today. Amazing. Yep, I'm on 51 followers now. Amazing. Well, I'm going to have to do that Harry Potter Quidditch stream now. Excellent. Please die already, you giant bird plane. Flashing red, finally. Come on, please. Just die. No! Just catching up with chat. <laughs> Thanks, Danny. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Dom. Are you enjoying Cyberpunk? I'm having quite a bit of fun on it. It just feels like a Fallout game with um, with a Cyberpunky skin. Like I'm just playing it in exactly the same way I play Fallout 4. <laughs> oh, missiles! Of course you have missiles. These guys are strong and fast.
Ufff Can't make any mistakes. <laughs> None at all. If, uh, if anyone has anything then you need to look at in chat. Just use the uh, exclamation mark codec uh, command and that'll do the Metal Gear Solid bleep bleep noise and I'll look down. Oh, those missiles are pesky. Mm, I think that might have been a bad idea. No. Oh. Just want the missile. Yeah, got it. Extra life, yes. See double Gatling cannons and oh, oh, this is nice. Oh, no, not that nice. Post a link or send, uh, whisper it to Danny Bowles, and if it's uh, appropriate or you know relevant, he can repost it for you. Metal Gear Solid 2. You might need to send it to, in a whisper to uh, to Danny Valls. Although maybe he can. Yeah, I think so. I, I wish I knew how to turn that off. But, but I, every time I look in the uh, mod dashboard, there's no auto mod settings. I I don't. It, <coughs> it's like the auto mod's got a life of its own. I wonder if I have to use um, uh, Streamlabs website to, to modify it rather than just the Twitch dashboard. But I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm choking on nothing. Why won't this guy die? He's like a turtle. Sort of just uh, doing it on manual, like automatic now. Manual, the opposite of manual. Oh, he's flashing now. There we go. Ooh, sneaky. <laughs> Keep trying. Yeah, I will pause and we'll see if we can sort this out. I'll just roll over to the uh, stream scene.
Well, it's, it's had a little bump at some point. If you take a look at the fourth picture, the corner of the box is a bit smushed. <laughs> Let me just catch up with the chat, hence the Metal Gear Solid stuff. Uh, you bought MSG, uh, MG, MSG, you bought <laughs> Metal Gear Solid and Metal Gear Solid 2 off GOG. You bought a big box copy of Metal Gear Solid for the PC. Ah, that's the pick, okay. You wish you could play, yeah Dom, I, I wish I could play Metal Gear Solid 2 for the first time again as well. And the first one, man. Just, uh... Yeah, it's, I mean, it's in better condition than most of the games behind me. They're pretty raggedy, my games. Yeah, have, the big box ones are nice, man. You get all that extra artwork and stuff. Oh, I like it when people post stuff like that. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for sharing. Yeah. We're on level 14, and I'm almost out of credits and lives. the missiles every time. That's it. Game over. We got as far as level 14. And we didn't even beat Dread Pirate Rob. Not bad score though. Right, next time I play this I will start at level 14. Or maybe, maybe I'll start at level 10. So maybe I should see what it lets me start at first. Uh, boo boo. So we can, yeah, level 14 is where we can start. Oh man, we were pretty close. Four levels left. Demon Star Base. But yeah, the multiplayer, you just create a, uh, a host, you TCP IP, you can do it. I mean, that's my network address, but I can set up the ports and whatever. If I remember correctly, <laughs> 50 follows average three viewers hasn't changed but now it's a minimum of seven streams and 500 minutes streamed over 30 days oh that's fine i've already hit the minutes because my streams are like um two how, how, how long is five hours? My streams are normally about five hours long, so all I have to do is do one bonus stream for like an hour and I meet the criteria. So I will do that this week, I, as I said earlier to whoever was the brave soul that suggested that I play fucking Quidditch World Cup game. 
I will play the Quidditch Girl Cup game <laughs> as the reward for hitting 50. Um, who was it who said that? Because that was hilarious. Was it uh, Matt Hickey? Um, I'm just looking back through the chat now. I can't find it now. Side laser strike again. Um, not Raptor, no. I think it was Matt Higgy. Yeah. <laughs> right, well, we'll have to do a special stream for him then. And I will post it on YouTube so I can watch it back as well. Well, this means if I do my bonus stream and I qualify for the, um, is it affiliate? It's affiliate, isn't it? And then I should get channel points and I can do subs then and all of the stuff. Um, and I'll have to get some ideas for, for, for channel points. Definitely, um, yep, I need to put MSN there. Uh, no, I don't need autocomplete, thank you very much. And you don't need to show me that warning. <laughs> Spade cannot be displayed. Why? Oh, because it's HTTPS, probably. Har har har. Yeah. Okay, fine. Be like that. I'll use Firefox then. And pride. Twitch cost. <laughs> Don't say that. I'm sure that's against the terms of service. I, I know that there's better, better browsers for 98 than Firefox. And uh, is it is it Sea Monkey or something? I can never remember what the right version is though. Um, but this will have to do. Did I copy and paste it? I don't think I did. I mean, this would be so much faster if I did it on another computer and moved the files onto this one. Netscape Navigator. I don't... Did Netscape Navigator ever support HTTPS, though? Like, I know that there's a new version of Netscape now, isn't it, for gamers, or is that something else? Firefox is having a cry. <laughs> I think uh, Firefox has died, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Firefox. Anyway. I've got some things actually I want to pop on on this machine. Um, Pixel Ships was great, by the way, Danny. I enjoyed that so much. Um, let me just grab file uh, clients. Yep. Do do do. Let's see. Um, probably. Five. Wait, don't want Chinese. Blah. English. Oh, well, they only have unpatched versions now. Okay, patched version of five, please. I feel like I need an earlier version, but we'll try. I feel like it was version four or something. That's what I wanted. I don't know why they're not offering the patched versions for the earlier versions anymore, but whatever. Oops. Yep. 
Yes. Yes, it would. Why does it want the 98 disc? Joy hid VDX. All right. There you go. That was probably what was causing the problems with um with the other joystick. Some corrupted Windows driver. Fun times. Anyway, it's uh plug in the old USB stick. Mm-hmm. So, two things. So see, I need an older version. It's rubbish. I wonder if I've got one on the server. I don't even know if I can access the server on here. It's plays up. Yeah. You see, I don't know how to get around this because this is not the right resource. It's... I need to specify the username. I don't I don't know what IPC dollar sign is. It's not not right. Um, most of them are original, the uh, at least from backups of the original install media. So that I I try and use rather than GOG, I try and use original media copies and then patch them to the latest version with the officially released patches. And then if the game is still completely dead because of they shut off networking or or they did something to it in a later patch and it broke it for earlier, I'll either use an earlier patch or I'll use a community patch. Uh, so uh, 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 an example of that is is this. Um, I was playing Dark Forces the other day, and it was good, and it was just the normal CD version with a patch on. Uh, but then I discovered this. So this is a community improvement that I wanted to install. Come on. No, I don't want to do that. Come on. Dark Forces, here we go. Um, info. Text. It's called uh, Dark Forces D Hacker. And it adds full mouse support and a bunch of other modern things. Command line options, blah, blah, blah. Nope, don't want that. I just want to know how to install it. Yeah, disable the CD checking. Well, I don't like that anyway because I like the music. Actually, no, it doesn't use the CD for music because it's all MIDI. So there you go. Um, always run, auto aim disabled. Weapon crosshair, better mouse sensitivity, all that jazz. Right, so I probably don't need the sources folder because that's the. <sighs> Bloody 7 zip. If I press extract and put in the folder, it's fine. Okay, so that bat file's already there. What's the difference? Is there even a difference? I'm sure there is, otherwise they wouldn't have included it. Hmm. No, it seems identical. So, I'll just make sure I'm using the one provided. Now, for bloody hell. <laughs> yeah, so it's the same, the same file size and the same date. Whatever. So... Hmm. 
So that's just normal config. Same changes, no. Hack setup, yes. Vert speed logic, always run. No, I like the running when I want to run. Keep jumping while jump is held down. No. Mouse fire secondary instead of strafe, yes. Disable auto aim for weapon projectiles, yes. Display weapon crosshair, yes. Oh. Toggle pixel. Oh, okay. Okay, I want a single pixel in the center. Save. Better mouse sensitivity scale for both axes. Yes. Two times. Default vertical mouse movement. Inverted. I'm use music MIDI driver fix. Use this if the game or sound hang set up. It doesn't hang, so that's fine. So what's this? In-game mouse behavior. Allow mouse for vertical look. Set up forward and backward for the y-axis required. With inverted vertical mouse movement. So, is it this one? Set up forward and backward for y-axis. Okay. Forward and backward for Y axis. I must just grab the uh, grab the commands and re uh, re thingy them. I think I might need to this one strafe mode as firing yeah set up strafe mode as firing button okay so I do need to go to configure mouse and I need to set strafe mode to the right button Save. Save settings and exit. Real. Oh. Don't need that. Dark Forces, yeah. Oh my god, it's like a whole new game. Right, playing it in Windows is a bad idea though. Um, it really does like to be run in proper DOS. But that's amazing, mouse look in Dark Forces. Yes, I was just setting up uh, Dark Forces D-Hacker, um, which like, Adds full mouse look, <laughs> which is amazing. Hmm. I wish I knew what what caused the um the 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 shortcut icon to just bugger off.
Not sure. I know that there's a power tool, isn't there? A Windows power tool. I don't know if I've got it installed though. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> like a, a nice bit of programmer humor. Right. It's getting a little bit dark in here and and it's cold as well. So I'm gonna shut the door, put a jumper on. Uh I'll be right back. There we go. All wrapped up now. Hmm. <laughs> well, what to do? Um, ooh. Okay. Let's reinstall that uh, <laughs> the tiger thing. But it did also update the driver, which is nice. Well, the, the generic HID device driver. Interesting. Very interesting. How about... This. Oops, I quit it. <laughs> Great, good job. Good job, me. Um. So it's using the wrong keyboard. Not the keyboard, wrong controller. So I just have to beep, boop, boop. Just remove that one real quick. Brilliant. Metal Gear Solid. What's the volumes like? Sorry about my microphone. It's been a bit overly sensitive recently. Aha! What's wrong? Snake! Snake! To stop the terrorist nuclear attack, one must deactivate the detonation code or destroy Metal Gear itself. Snake and Merrill head to the commu communications tower, the only way to un the underground maintenance base. However, on their way to the underground passage, Foxhound member Sniper Wolf fires at Merrill. Acquiring the PSG-1, the only weapon effective to fight against Wolf, Snake heads back to the underground passage to save Merrill. Right. That's what we're doing. Snake, you got a PSG-1. Um... I've gone um, first person for some reason, and the controller is has got a mind of its own. Okay, there we go, that's why. I was pressing a button when I turned the analog on, alright. 
Who remembers where the underground the, the, the communications bunker is? Are we already on B2? Who knows where I'm supposed to go? I can't remember. Through here? Danny. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't say Sniper Wolves, to be honest. I mean, we've all got our preference, right? Let's say, are there any of these I haven't been in yet? That's grab, it's punch, it's nail. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's killing me. Oh. Do I have any rations? I don't. Ah, missile launcher ammo. Okay, I'm full on that. C4. Real. All that latex. <laughs> he does wear a lot of latex. Where is he going to go? Oh, he's coming this way. How's the volume? Should I turn it up a little bit? For fuck's sake. No! <laughs> I'm so fucked. To the left. I don't have my card. <laughs> it's all gone wrong. Goodbye. Maybe using the analog stick was a bad idea. Right. Well, we're boned now. Um, we've got all of the things except for... Rations. Um, I'm not even sure if we'd already got the PSG one. I mean, the trank rounds would be great. But we 
don't have them. Do I have to press it again to make it explode? I can't remember. Oh shit. And I'm dead. <laughs> right. One button to place it, one button to just set it off. Alright. What's wrong? Snake! Snake! <laughs> Let me check my guns. Thanks for that. Okay, so I still need to pick up the PSG one. So I was I would was doing the right thing. It's in this one. Is he gonna come? You go straight on, okay. It's not this one. It's the the one on the top left, isn't it? Right. Analog off. Well, I already don't like this. Am I supposed to blow up this barrel or something? Oh, yeah. Right. Oh. You got a PSG-1. You, you got a PSG-1, Snake. Ball. Hurry up and save Meryl. <laughs> Hurry up. dead from the sig use but that's fine okay we're going we're going where am i supposed to go now i don't remember <laughs> who do i i can't remember any of the codec numbers uh is it mei ling It's the same bloody menu. <laughs> they say rashness brings success to few, misfortune to many. Snake, go forward when it's safe, but retreat when there's danger. You'll just have to play it by ear depending on the circumstances. Thanks, Mei Ling. And <laughs> I don't do I have the night vision? Oh, I do have the night vision. I didn't know that. I'm not an amazing super person who knows all the things. Right, where the fuck do I... S where am I supposed to go? Oh. Oh, I died. 
Thank you for follow, Simon. <laughs> I'm not going to say you're directly responsible for that death, but you're directly responsible for that death. <laughs> Do I have the PSG one now? Oh, I don't. Right. Here we go. No, bollocks. <laughs> oh, that's not the right. <laughs> Thanks, Simon. <laughs> uh, Armory A is the correct save game. I don't know why Tank Hanger was at the top. That's weird. Here we go. Again. Here we go again. Oh shit. Right. Nice. So you say the night vision goggles, eh? Mm-hmm. Now, I don't see any... Uh... I don't see any... Um... Any infrared lasers with the uh, with the night vision goggles, unless I'm supposed to do something. I mean, I know where the laser is now, but oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> Just it's so finicky. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna we're gonna get the rifle, and we're gonna go to another area so that it saves. Save Meryl. Oh man, I, there was a phase of my life where I listened to. Um, I know, I know. You can laugh at me now. Dubstep, um, but not any old dubstep. There was specifically this one guy called DJ Mutagen, uh, and all of his stuff was on YouTube, and it was all live sets, and it was all Metal Gear Solid themed dubstep with codec noises <laughs> and random lines from the game. It was great. I loved it. Right. Where the fuck is that, is that guy going? He's gonna come around that way, okay. Run, 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 run. To the lift, oh no, the lift! Right, we're near. Yeah, I, I will totally dig some out and I'll use it for my, uh, my channel intro music next week. Wait. What? Why is the lift on? No, why is the lift locked down? Stand up, you prick! <laughs> why is the lift locked? Uh, is it because you're not supposed to go that way? What? <gasps> Who's that? I need somebody to tell me exactly what I'm supposed to do because my b mind is a blank at this part. I pick up the PSG one and then where the fuck am I supposed to go? Because I can't go back to the lift because it's magically shut now. You got a PSG one. Yes, I did. Get lost.
Yes. 52 now. Hello, Sarah. How was your digging? How was your allotment time? It's just so... <laughs> Somebody look it up. Where? Seriously, where am I supposed to go after I pick up the SPSG1? Or am I just dumb? Like, am I pressing the wrong button or...? The lift is just shut once I come out of it. Is it because my access card? Nope. X this card is correct. Ah. I have to call the lift. Okay. Alright. Man, I, you don't play a game for a little while and your brain is just like, nope. doing this. Okay. Now X is the button I press to call the lift. We're going to wait for it to be clear of guards completely and then we're going to leg it. No. No, 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 no. Oh. This is harder than I remember. Much harder than I remember. Please still be called. Please still be called. Yes. 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 Now, where do I go? Where, 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 where am I supposed to go to get to... I can't remember how to get to her. Is it is it through the hole at the bottom of B2?
Okay, it's not through there. Now there's a turret in here, isn't there? Or a camera or something. Yep. Which door is it? I don't remember. I don't remember where I'm supposed to go. That's a level six door. A ration! Right, so where the fuck am I supposed to go? I, I need to know. Somebody help! Ah! I wish I knew where I was supposed to go. Uh, af PSG 1. Like, I guess walk through PSG 1 and it's immediately after requiring the PSG 1. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? I just need a reminder what floor it's on or what door it is. Because I have no idea. Not a clue. Come on, door. Come on. Oh, fuck's sake. Um. Oh, no. I don't have the thermal goggles. Okay, so I want what's after that. So I have to retrace my steps back where? From from the tank hangar? I think it's saved. Have I still got the... Yes, I do. Okay. So what? I go back up to the top floor. Okay, this way. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So back up to the first level. And then through the... through here. I can't remember if this is the room with the lasers in, so I'm just going to crawl anyway. <laughs> Ok, 
Okay. And I go around the outside. And I use the mind detector. It's <laughs> alright, we're making progress. <laughs> so, I want... Nowhere near that mine. I need, like an app that hides the mouse when you're running full screen games in Windows 98 because it always randomly reappears. Right, my detector. So am I just supposed to crawl past it? I think that's what you're supposed to do, isn't it? Yeah, you just crawl past them. <gasps> oh no, 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 no. I'm so very nearly dead. I think if I'm right, isn't there a ration in this office? Yes. Thanks. Thanks, Sarah. Thanks, Danny. Right. Now, where the fuck do I go? Is it to the lift? Or is it the north wall? Ah. Oh. doing it <gasps> no I'm in the shadows you can't see me get up get up get up <gasps> faster 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 oh fuck no <laughs> he always lies down ah uh, poison gas Nah, I'm so, I'm so fucking dead. Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake? Yes, it's a it's a it's a Reddit post. I think I think it's still up. It's like a community project to um to make it work on Windows modern Windows 10 with like graphics improvements. You just download the pack and run it. I'm wondering if I can uh, gamer this and just get full health and full rations. Mm. 
Nope. Game's too smart. So how did I miss the thermal goggles then? Where are they? I should have them by now, but I don't. Oh, I know the gas mask would have saved me, but, um, also, um, you know, I was already being shot at and I had no health, so no way I was going to get out of that. Is there nothing in this fucking room? Yeah. Okay, this is the everybody's dead corridor. Is that a Sega Saturn? That looks like a Sega Saturn to me. Anyway. So there's Nath all in here. Some silicon bullets, great. They're all dead, Dave. Everybody's dead, Dave. Everybody's dead, Dave. They're all dead, Dave. Everybody's dead, Dave. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, 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 no. I don't even need to be here, do I? I'm just wondering if I've missed anything. That's a level six door. dead. I'm pretty sure there's nothing down here I've missed. 
Oh, the net Eurosa, yeah. Nice. Get lost, get lost, get lost, get lost. Bleep bloop, bleep bloop, bleep bloop. So this is the wrong floor. I'm not supposed to be here. I've already done the stupid missile puzzle thing here. So, B1. Right, yeah, this is familiar, I think. And then we go through... That's it, we go through Psychomantis' office, because he's dead now. Yep, 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 yep. And then we go through here, I remember now. And we go, yum, yum, yum. A ration, hooray, life saved. Okay, progress. And then, do I put on, which box do I put on? <laughs> I know this is unnecessary, but I do enjoy being silly. Ah, is the, aren't the night vision go the thermal goggles in here somewhere, right? No, but I've got night vision. What's the difference between the thermal and? Hmm. Wait, where's the hole? Oh, do I need to blow something up here? I lost the plot. What's oh wait, I forget do the doggos like me now? I can't remember. Yes, there we go. Oh woof. Hey guys. But I need to get through here and I can't without Oh my god. Um, mm. Okay, guys. Nice to see ya. Oh, wait. Do they like me full stop now? I'm so confused. That's it. I think that's all I needed to do. Yeah. Okay, we found some bullets. Well, it's on the box. I think one of the dogs peed on the box? Or maybe I'm gonna oh yeah they like me now oh oh no that, that one doesn't only the little one does and now I'm totally dead uh... there we go you like this box though yeah yeah it's on the box they like the box <laughs> they don't like me Oh, 
Where are the thermal goggles? And are they different to the night vision goggles? There's a hole there. Yeah, I think that's the hole I'm supposed to go through. I think we're good. Whew. Okay, this is the right place. Yep, there's wolves. I can't see her at all. <laughs> Come on, game. <laughs> right, so lying down's a bad idea. Nope. Don't do that. The controls are a little messed up, which is unfortunate, but whatever. <clears throat> I want some... Yeah, that's great. <clears throat> I'm gonna take one of those. I wanna stand up. And I wanna use the gun. Okay, I'll lie down anyway. I have no idea what's going on now. And she shot me again. Is there a trick to this? She wasn't even standing still. Oh, this is bollocks. Hey, Mr. PK. I'm <clears throat> played Demon Star earlier, trying to remember where I'm at on Metal Gear right now. Um, this game has lots of weird of its time quirks. Wait, no, I saved it in that room. Yeah, under passage. Thank you. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, it's right outside the door, okay. That's fine. Right, okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's my name. <laughs> right. <clears throat> uh, it's not fair. Like, I'm not even... When am I supposed to get an opportunity to shoot? It takes so long to aim. Like, <clears throat> am I doing something wrong? Those are mice. Ow. Ow. Don't know what the controls are. <laughs> They're so messed up. They're not right at all. Hold on a minute. I need to fix these controls because it's really throwing me off. Right. So. Inventory weapon. And switch weapon. So switch weapon should be. Press enter to change. Should be button five. And then inventory weapon should be button seven. Yeah, so. Switch item should be button 4, and switch item should be button 6. Why was that so messed up? Right, that's fine. Continue. Oh yeah, that's... Actually, I feel like I've got them mixed up as well. So that's turn them on. And that's change them. Okay, you know what, I can live with that. Right. Um, if I take any more Diazepam, I'm going to be falling asleep. Oh, she dodged it. Wait, that's supposed to reload. What? Do I not have any bullets? Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, running. <coughs> oh, been going for a long time without a drink. Well, I can have a hydrate command soon. Yay. Got her. Oof. <clears throat> Poor sniper wolf. That was nice. Yeah, woo. We did it. No, don't call it back. No. No, I already saved. It's fine. Go away, Mailing. Dum dum. Got a door over there. We've got some stuff over there. A ration. 
some Socom bullets. There's a passage down there. Being blocked by that barrel. your weapon over here slowly oh no <coughs> you are a fool to come back here stupid man a lady sniper huh didn't you know that two thirds of the world's greatest assassins are women do you want to die now or after your female friend which will it be I'll die after I kill you. Is that right? Well, at least you've got spirit. I am Sniper Wolf, and I always kill what I aim at. Oh. What's GSE? What am I? Special prey. Got it. Do you mean like an analog stick? Until I kill you, you're all I think about. He's giving you whiplash. Oh no. Take him away. <laughs> oh, well this is running in glide. This is a uh, this PC PC glide version, yeah. So it it doesn't have quite have the same wobble. Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh, is it catch-up time? Or is it just torture time? He's tougher than I thought. Do you know? always knew that one day I would meet you. The man James Miller, is that you? What was rightly mine. <laughs> the man who Shut up, Liquid. stole my birthright. Mm -mm. Me? I'm the man you stole everything good from. And now, after the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, Finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Wow, it's a good job that um, that texture they're using full screen is uh, not terrible quality with tearing artifacts. We need it to correct the genome soldiers' mutations. Then we'll be able to cure them. No, we still have to get our hands on Big Boss's DNA. Have they given in to our demands yet? Not yet. They won't give in. They're all Oh, I can't look around. Every one of them. Is that your opinion as a curb? They always put politics first. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. Uh-oh. There definitely is a resemblance. Oh, man. Don't you I've only done this brother? once. Or should I say, big brother. I mean, I mean successfully like anyway, beaten the torture. It doesn't matter. You and I are both the last surviving sons of Big Boss. It's me. Really? Then what? Oof, those idiots. All right, Raven. I'll be right there. They're not responding to our demands. We launched the first one in ten hours as planned. Damn Americans. Damn Looks Americans. Like you read them wrong. Something's funny. 
Normally the Americans are the first ones I can't not think of all the things from uh, Metal Gear Awesome when playing this. Leaves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. What about you? Want to stay for the show? <laughs> hungry for words? No! Hungry for worms! <laughs> it's me, Donald Miller. <laughs> So you prefer your wolves to my show, huh? <laughs> it's my stomach also, growling. Don't screw up like you did with the chief. <laughs> yes, this I is know. the greatest yeah, handgun nice. in the world. I think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, hmm. his mental defenses were reinforced <laughs> by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, he's some kind of lunatic. Bastard. See if I can. My hand. <laughs> How could he have gotten in here? Perhaps there's a spy on Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out now. I don't have case, octopus, so we're short handed. So make this, although I do have the PlayStation version, so I'll have to go downstairs and find the case to get Meryl's uh, number, codec number. As you wish, <laughs> see you later, brother. Brother, <laughs> oh my god, have you seen? <laughs> All five polygons of haboobs. <laughs> Once she a target, she doesn't think oh god! Else. Hilarious. What is that? <laughs> she kills them. Good job. <laughs> Good job, Hideo Kojima. <laughs> How are you feeling? Not oh. bad. Sorry. Got a nice nap on this revolving bed of yours. Too bad. It was on. The, it was on the back of the case as well on PC. Or the back of the box, I think. I'm about to show you some of but, um, of features. I don't have the box. Oh, don't so you have the box? Is it on the back of the box? Taking quite a chance <laughs> you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? Oh, the Mantis battle. So um, you, uh, you, you use the, an ul the, ul the alternate control scheme. So I'm using a controller, so that's the alternate scheme. So I just was fine. If I'd been using the keyboard, I would have been boned. What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data. What do you mean? There's no copy. If not, that's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. What if you want her to stay that way? You better start answering my questions right now. You were holding one card key. Where are the other two? What's the trick behind that key? Trick? That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. I see. No problem then. We're going to play a game, Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear. Just give up, and your suffering will end. What if you do? The girl's life is mine. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my friend. Don't even think about using auto fire, or I'll know. Oh, no. I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. Yeah, right. I am sure usually using a PlayStation guys. controller, but I think I have action map to X, not circle, so we'll see what happens. You're no POW. <laughs> You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. No, my arm's unattached to my body. Okay, let's get started. Ooh, excuse me. Hmm. Okay, here we go. How did you like that? I'm gonna do it like this. Shall we go again? Had 
enough yet? <laughs> We're not finished yet. I'm not even looking. Just pressing the button. <laughs> yes. You're a strong man. Ow, my hand. <laughs> well, that's enough for now. I think. That's enough for now. You don't think he's quite You're got the, the point of torture? Brother, Your brother, he's an amazing man. Who else could shoot down two F-16s with a hind helicopter? The Le Lefant <laughs> project was not a total failure. He is the one man who could make my dream into a reality. Is that that awful children? Is that the na code name of that program? Les Enfants Terribles. Awful kids. <laughs> That's what we'll call our uh, top secret project. We'll call it Awful Kids. In French, because it's edgy. <laughs> huh? Looks like I got a roommate. DARPA chief? Whew. What a stench. Yeah, I caught a cold. That witch. She took my clothes. Is that Johnny? Yeah, that's what I thought. Who's Jean? Who's Johnny? You've played Metal Gear games, haven't you? There's always a guy who's having a terrible time, who's a soldier, who's either is an idiot or is shitting himself. That's Johnny. Yeah, <laughs> that's the guy. Yeah. <laughs> The whole game revolves around Johnny, the big boss and, and, and Solid Snake aren't the uh, the main character of the Metal Gear series, it's always been Johnny. He's been there since the beginning, right? I don't know if he's in, uh, if he's in, um, Snake Eater. Metal Gear Johnny. <laughs> His dad is in Metal Gear Solid 3. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Something in his blood that they wanted? 
I doubt it. It's just the nano machines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It looks like they've got both codes and are nearly ready to launch. Damn. Is there any way to prevent it? It seems that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. It's a countermeasure that Arms Tech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. Sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also, what? Meryl, right? Yeah. I'll save her. Thanks. Right. Oh, the bed thing worked. Shut up! Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up in there, will ya? Snake, it's showtime. Ocelot wants you. How many times do I have to do this? And also, where do I get ketchup from? Okay. I'll tell you once more. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. I mean, is that it right there? You've <laughs> had enough. Press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game... you like that? Shall we go again? <laughs> Had enough yet? Blah. We're not finished yet. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to hide under the bed, right? Was I just timing it wrong? You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for. Yeah, he definitely doesn't know how torch is supposed to work. says anything I'm not a very good talker please tell me about yourself myself that's a tough one any family <sighs> that's not a happy topic for me I don't have any family no wait there was a man who said he was my father where is he dead by my <laughs> own hand big boss what? Big Boss? I had no idea. There was no way you could. It happened in Zanzibar. Six Zanzibar! Years ago. Only Snake <laughs> and I know the real truth of what happened there. Uh. So, is it true? Was Big Boss really your father? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill him, knowing that? 
Yep. Yep. Wow. <laughs> he wanted it. Besides, some people just need killing. That's patricide. Yep. That's the drama that Mantis was talking about. One we share in common. Is that why you left Foxhound? Let's just say that I needed to be alone for a while. And Alaska was the perfect place. <sighs> Snake. I didn't yep. have a real family either. Hey, Dom. Just a big brother who put me through school. How's the plastering going? We weren't even blood related and he was much older than me. Where is he? He's dead. I'm sorry. Snake. Is there a woman in your life? After you've been through as many wars as me, it's hard to trust anyone. Hmm. Friends? Roy Campbell. <sighs> You're still calling me friend? Is that it? No. There was another. Frank Yeager. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. And the only member of Fox Sound ever to receive the code name Fox. Fox. Gray Fox. Gray Fox. I learned a lot from him. But didn't you try to kill each other? That's true. We did. It never we ends, you know. But it was nothing personal. We were just professionals on opposite sides, that's all. And you still call yourself friends? Hard to believe. War is no reason to end a friendship. That's insane. I first met him on the battlefield. He was being So much lore happening friend. right now. But he didn't look like a prisoner. Gray Fox! He was always so cool and precise. I was still green, and he showed me the ropes. You knew him well? No. We never talked about our personal lives. Sort of an unwritten rule. The next time I saw him on the battlefield, we were enemies. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. I know it sounds strange to most people, but we were just two soldiers doing our jobs. It's like a sport. Men in their games. You're like wild animals. You're right. We are animals. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. It's your genes. They make you predisposed towards violence. You really like talking about genes, Naomi. Why did you get into genetic research anyway? I never knew who my parents were, or even what they looked like. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why I am the way I am. So you studied about DNA? <laughs> yeah. I thought if I studied my genetic structure, I'd find out who I really was. I thought that by analyzing a person's genetic information, I could retrieve the blank spots in that person's <laughs> memory is stored in DNA. <laughs> yeah, you're sure, too right. But we know that a person's genetic fate is determined. Just by the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. But to be honest, I could listen to this music for hours. You could literally put anything up against it. It's so good. I'm sorry, I have no idea. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Right, now, what I know I'm supposed to do something here. Do I just lie under the bed and I have to time it right? I thought there was something with ketchup. That's it, yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. Oh! Yep. Oh, oh, oh. You should probably go for a shit. Yep, 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 yep. And now we wait. Oh, bastard. 
This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing here then? I... I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Yes, also, ketchup. I got you this level six card. It'll get you out yes. of the torture room. Here, take this too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. <laughs> I was taking care of the dogs here. After the terrorists took over, they were planning to shoot all the dogs. But Sniper Wolf stopped them. She even let me feed them when I asked. She likes dogs. She must be a good person. Please don't hurt her. Wake up, you idiot. She's the one <laughs> shot Meryl. <laughs> well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a nuke. I've got to stop them. Then you have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard got the key. <laughs> it's a Don't syndrome. As, and it's named after the place, yeah, because there was a hostage situation that happened there. And that person, the person who was being held hostage, started to depend on their captors. And then they refused to, it like messed them up. Oh, jeez. He's coming back. See you later. Yeah, he is. Wait. All oh, right, <laughs> Lel. Huh? He's gone. Oh, what, you're going to shoot me for hiding under the bed? Okay, fine. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Ah, oh, I timed it so wrong. I haven't saved in a while either. Hmm. Oh, I've got to do it again. All right. Lol. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. Is that Johnson and Johnson? Press the no relation. How did you like that? Shall we go? Ah, uh, the news reporter. <laughs> Guy gets punched in the face much. It's like, what's your family Christmas tradition? Oh, punching this reporter in the face every Christmas. You know, after being in a hostage situation. Had enough yet? Oh no, I don't know if I'm going to survive We're this one. Not finished yet. Oh, <laughs> uh, not the smoke brick. <laughs> no. Definitely no yes. cocaine. You did, you did it again. Sorry, boss. Sorry, boss. Bums. Bums. <laughs> There's so much dialogue I have to listen to again. I should have saved it when I was in the fucking prison. Why did nobody save? Why did... Well, that's enough Metal Gear for today. 
Uh, yep, goodbye. Uh, nope, don't save game, just quit. Beep. I did save. I've, I've killed, what's her name, but I, I've got to go through the torture again and all that exposition and um, I can't be arsed. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Previous operations. Or is it just more text? Ah, uh, right, yeah, because just in case you didn't have a, uh, what was it, the PC engine. <laughs> you got tonsillitis. <laughs> Interesting. Um... Nope. Hmm. What am I looking for? I'm looking for this. Tweak UI. What I want. I wonder if it's already installed. Secret cheese? You having secret cheese without me? I want secret cheese. That's a really weird place to keep Baby Bell. Why would you do that? Now, where the fuck has it put it? Where's Tweak UI? It says it's installed it. But where? Where has it installed it to? Hmm. I guess it'll be in the uh in the Windows folder.
tweak. Oh, it's in control panel. Okay. There it is. Ha ha. Uh, desktop. Repair. Rebuild icons. So there's a paranoia tab. That's better. Hmm. Well, what to do now? Let's see. I've got about about half an hour to do something chill. Um. Hmm. Oh, I should probably make a note while I remember. About the silly Harry Potter game. Okay. Hmm. Oh, you mean on the Steam version? I'd have no idea. They did. Uh, they did. They just did weird stuff for a little while, didn't they? Wow, this is so much more playable since I, uh, since I got the correct tripset drivers. Wow, what a difference that's made. Still slow down a little bit in a few areas, but, wow, it's a spectacular difference. Do I really not have a more up-to-date save than this? Yeah, all of these ones. Um, auto save. Five forty seven. Quick save. Yeah, that's better.
No. Oh, yeah. No. It does it twice and then stops. Uh, the version build is 1110. Build 2056. Half-Life Alex, I, I did enjoy you watching that. Oh, hey, Matt. <laughs> Sorry, I am right. This is pretty much how I played it when it first came out. I wonder if I could uh, maybe down the resolution a little bit. I mean, that's not the right button at all, is it? Configuration video modes currently use the wicked gl driver at android by 600 oh it probably doesn't help this the camera's like fallen over and it's at a slight angle and isn't even looking at me properly how's that Should be in the center. Yeah, no, that's something to do with the patch, I believe. It, it that slowdown is some kind of blending effect. Yeah, look, I, 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 yeah, I'm definitely running at the wrong.
I mean, it's still sluggish. <laughs> I don't really feel like it's any faster. It's just a lower resolution. I think the thing that's uh, that's not it, the thing that's holding this system back isn't the graphics card; it's the CPU. Um, I mean, you can get 600 megahertz K6s, but they're really hard to find. They're so expensive. Yeah, I'll try the uh, mini 3D FX driver as well. It's about the same. I was using the Wicked GL driver because it just it does slightly better frame rate at a high resolution. Oh, in fact, it's like better, better frame rate at all resolutions. Yeah, look at that. Uh, was that like 10 frames per second? And I mean, I could probably do this as well. Get another 50 megahertz out of it. Yeah, that's about as good a performance as I'm going to get out of it. I mean, I could always play it in software mode. Ha 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 ha. I had a grenade left. Yeah, about as bad. <laughs> uh, I mean, this, this, this is a ball mouse that is on the way out. I should probably change the mouse to a better mouse, but you know. It's part of the experience, isn't it? That's definitely the right music. Um. Hmm. 
Also, can that's right, Counter Strike on a CD. <laughs> right. Oh, I'm already playing Half Life. No. Why would you do this? Yay! It's playing the right music now. Kablam! Boss time. Where's the ow, ow, ow? Yeah, that's definitely not going to uh, hit me with a copyright strike, is it? Oh! Oh, there's my head. Mmm, chunky. That's fine. Who needs health anyway? It's alright, I've got the best health. Shame. Oh. I remember being here earlier. Nom nom nom. Oh, 
I am lost. Hmm. Maybe it's one of these I'm supposed to come out of. Nice that it let me have a little explore, though. I'm dead. smoother on the capture than it does actually playing it. <laughs> well, I've got three 50, 53 bullets, so... There you go. There's a fighting back scientist for you. Do 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 do. Wop. Oh, they're not all good guys. Some of them are awful. Like that guy there. He's like, I just want to kill stuff. Urgh. Why do I sound like I'm from Texas? Urgh. I mean, I, I know where the studio was, but... <laughs> okay, so we've done... All of this rubbish. Save. Yes, I have opposing force. There we go. Oh man. Don't even anything in that one. Yeah, I, uh, Opposing Force is great. Like, back when Gearbox actually, you know, was good. I mean, Gearbox is still alright. They've made some pretty cracking games, like, um... Like, uh, Brothers in Arms and stuff. Well, so Hello. The Their idea of Don't make me sad, Danny. You know that Randy Pitchford is sitting on the gold uh, copy of the Duke Nukem Forever uh, 2001 version. You know, the one with that amazing E3 trailer. He's sitting on a near complete version of that that he won't release. Because he's an asshole. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
it makes me sad because that looked like the greatest the greatest game that ever could have been in the 90s anyway the early early 2000s it's all right you can't type i can't talk we're all christmasly handicapped i'm guessing Oh, Blast Pit, okay. No, I can go back and blap him in the face if you want. A blap blap in the face or a th -th dunk in the face? There you go. It wouldn't be Half-Life without one scientist murder. And no one will ever know. And I'll go on to be the hero of Earth. Smashy smash! Ah! Ow! Okay, so big hole with ladder clipping through door. I think we need to use this lev lever? Lever. Oh. Yay, my favorite glitch. Another crowbar. Womp. Hmm. They hunger. Maybe. I remember there being some really good Half-Life mods. Like, there was Scientist Hunt, which was hilarious. It had traps and a hilarious giant hammer that made them just explode into Gibbs. Um, there was a tongue-in-cheek... I'm just going to pause it a sec. Uh, there was a tongue-in-cheek semi-serious Half-Life expansion. Like It was a mod, but it was like a, a, a canon, sort of non-canon expansion, where you played a janitor. <laughs> that was the role. <laughs> you know, you're just security guard, scientist, the uh, angry army guy, and then janitor. That was great. Um, they hunger. Yeah, was it like a early zombie survival -y game? And you know, had classes and stuff.
<laughs> handle of an umbrella, nice. Okay. No, it was slammed for being terrible. Apparently it's still broken. There are like parts of it that are just bust. Perfect. Now, let me crawl into this exploded pipe underneath all this radioactive waste. Ah, oh, fell off. I'm sure there's nothing awful in this pipe. Woo, 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 wibbly, wibbly, woo. Ha 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 yeah, it's so broke. Ow. Ow. Okay. I had the long jump module. I like, I like Black Mesa. What's wrong with Black Mesa? I've been following it for so long. Uh... You know what? I haven't played through Black Mesa since the first version of the mod came out. I've been saving it. I don't know why. I want to play through all the... Uh... The Zen levels. And, but I wanted to play through the whole game from scratch because it's changed so much since I played it last. Oh, right. I'm sorry. Um, it's... it's... I'm a dum-dum. <laughs> <laughs> it 
So we can all agree the research facility is a bag of shit. Um, but the game, top notch. <laughs> Ow. Oh. I don't care if that was a regular hive scientist hiding behind there. I've, I've no, has nobody at Black Mesa ever heard of, like, hazardous material storage? Like, these explosive compounds should be kept in special bomb-proof lockers when they're not being used. Not just, you know, on important walkways to a giant nuclear silo filled with radioactive waste. Just, it's a huge code violation, this whole place. Later, Danny! Peter guy doesn't need my radies. He's, uh, he's well famous. I don't know what's going on in my English, sorry. Um, <laughs> he's really famous. Okay, toodles. It's kind of like playing Chocolate Doom if you've only been used to playing Z Doom. Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh, I tell you now, it was pretty great. <laughs> Quiet, this thing hears us, immediately walks out to go shoot it. Ladder still makes a noise in this one. There you go, guys. Go follow that.
No, I've still got... Oh, I think I've still got... The demo disc where I first played Half-Life. Let's have a look at the year. Um... Yeah, here we go. I think this is the one. Let's check. Yeah. There you go. So that's dated May 1999. And I believe that's the... Um, I believe that's the... Uh, it has a funny name, doesn't it? It's not the actual game. It's like a it's a little tiny demo level. It's um What's its name? <laughs> so yeah, there's the box. That's my edition of Half-Life. The Generations one with opposing force and the original Half-Life and Counter-Strike. Um Uplink, that's it. Thank you. Uplink. Um, but I also have Blue Shift as well. Back there. Which I got uh, from Game when it was still a thing. Oh no, it was called Electronics Boutique back then. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, you can, you can totally, no, it does appear in the full game. It's the only thing listed in the custom game section. Half-Life Uplink, there. Yeah, by default, it's the only thing listed here. And then if you update to um, the newer patches, you get Team Fortress and Counter-Strike and Ricochet. That wonderful game that everybody loved, Ricochet. <laughs> Deathmatch Classic and Opposing Force and stuff. Yeah. So it is there. You can play it if you've uh, patched the game to, like, the very first patch, 101. Yes. <laughs> It is. <laughs> yep. Uh, that's something to do with batch files. Ow, my legs. I feel like a good large percentage of the health lost in this game is done by falling, by jumping off of ladders by accident. More grenades! Yay! 
my favorite. Hey, ease out. <laughs> You're totally. Oh, it's the big fan. Uh, bye, cruel world. Fuck you. Bitch. Easy. Um, I can't remember which one it is, but one of the virtual machine programs had a set of like tools that you could install in the, your Windows 98 virtual machine that added uh, 3D accelerated graphics, so you can totally play this. Um, I can't remember what it was though, and w whether it still works on Windows 10. Fortunately, you'll be nowhere near them. <laughs> right, let's try again. Nope, come on, ladder. I've fallen off. Somebody's pewing green at me. Try that again with a hundred percent less falling. Okay, now I just have to wait for it to get up to speed. I'm trying to remember if the grenades are affected by this as well. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Whee! Yuff. That's a lot of fun. Whee! Yep. <laughs> but I mean, this was the latest shit when this game came out. Hardware wise. I mean, if you were really rich, you could have an Athlon 800 or something. Uh, right, okay.
<laughs> yeah, exactly. It's a good job the explosives that are on this walkway only blew up the solid steel walkway and not these uh, flimsy pipes full of oxygen and fuel. Very lucky. Guys are green for some reason. <laughs> oh, I wish I had the Magnum. I do like how they get surprised. Oh my god, I'm out of pistol bullets. And I'm almost out of machine gun bullets. Have I been wasting ammo? I wonder if I sequence broke that. Hello. Wouldn't you like to get one of these blood samples under a microscope? That's not a blood sample. That's a bunch of dials. I hope no one expects me to start up the generator. Smithers went down there and never came back. Well, that's because he's Smithers. Luckily, I've got a hundred and five shotgun shells that say otherwise. Ow, ow, ow. Right. 
that will have to do. We. Ah, what the fuck? Hey, guy. So your hiding spot is a terrible hiding spot. I need to turn this on. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. So Smithers did make it all the way down here. Only to get electrocuted by me. Excellent. Someone has restored all power. We'll have the engine up again in no time. Thanks. No witnesses. A hobbyist biologist. Now, now you've just reminded me of Freeman's mind. When he sings that song. Oh no, that grenade! Bollocks. Yeah. We did it. Beep, beep. 
Blah, blah. Ow, 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 ow. Hot, ow. <laughs> Disco Inferno. Your order's up, extra crispy. Sorry. <laughs> wow, this wooden box survived the fire. <laughs> Yay, Magnum! Pew pew! Oh. Nope. Up was not the right way. Ow. Drowning. Ow. Drowning. Ah. You are drowning. Uh, you, your health goes back up if you were drowning, because it's only just a little bit of oxygen deprivation. Right, so none of those tubes. This thing's not solid in here. Do we want one of these? Nope, that just spins you around. Um, hmm. What am I missing? Probably an explosive solution. Ah, oh, looks like a way out. Hooray! Glad I wasted all those grenades. Yay, but we have my favourite gun now. Ah, yes, the radioactive log flume. Glad this bladder has a right way round. I'm pretty sure I have to ride the. No, I draw supposed to drop down there. Okay. Cool. I think if you're cool enough, you can ride the uh, the radioactive flume. Oh no, probably not. You just fall off and die. I wonder what that did. <laughs> ah. Just... 
pretty sure I was supposed to land on the medical supplies, but whatever. Oh, oh. Interesting. It crashed. I wonder why it did that. <laughs> Picking up those mines made it instantly crash. <laughs> <laughs> Very interesting. Uh, quick save. Uh, wait, what? I guess it's time elapsed into the mission or into the level file. Or the chapter? We did just finish a chapter. It's only six o'clock, I should probably finish soon. But, um, I'm enjoying myself. F indeed. I still can't believe there's so many of you watching. It's very kind of you. I see it closed something. I love that you can just jump on the table. Right, so there's the mine. And it's fine. It's fine. It was just that one time. Um, my advice to you about PC building is there are so many bits of good hardware that will pretty much play you every everything that isn't Cyberpunk 2077. Like, trying to get a rig that will play amazing future games that are way over engineered and dumb is completely pointless at the moment because of scalpers and the cost of cards like you could make a machine using new parts from the last few years um that is so much cheaper and brilliant for all of the games that have ever been made up until this year <laughs> and even then new games come out that would still be playable because cyberpunk is dumb collection are you looking at the collection which which collection are you looking at <laughs> but feel free to live through me that's, that's some nice geometry that's cool Yes, I have a 7970 that um, it's what was in my machine that I do all the streaming from until it uh, it went funny live on stream a couple of weeks ago. But I did fix it with a heat gun, so it was, uh, yeah. Wow, £30 from CX, that's a brilliant price. Yeah, like a 3 gig card or a, or a 4 gig card is, will play you pretty much anything apart from like the very latest titles at Max Graphics. I know, yeah. It's, I, I'm justifying the purchase. It was about 40 quid for that heat gun, for that uh, air, what do you call it? Um, solder rework station. Um. <laughs> and I've so far fixed a CPU pin, two graphics cards, a phone. Oh, nope. Excuse me. No. Ow.
Ow. Oh, it's a puddle. I'm being murdered by a slippery, slidey puddle. I'm the world's loudest boss. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, but I fixed a, gra a same graphics card, so I've already made my money back. Yep, that makes sense. Oh, I've fallen in the hazardous waste. No. My ability to bear children. Oh, no, it still hurts. Ow. Ah. 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 Stop shooting me. I don't have enough bullets. No! <laughs> I do have four grenades though. That's fine. I'm just gonna use use my new favorite gun. Yeah. Brilliant throw. Ten out of ten. Better than before. Good stuff, okay. Lots of ammo. Damn it. There's always one more head crab. Ah. 
No, no, I wanted to save that grenade. Very well. That was a little hairy, wasn't it? Oh, these little worm things eat you, don't they? What am I supposed to do? I can't remember. Go up, I suppose. That's okay. I forgot it was that Friday that one time. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm still gonna die!
Oh no, grenade. Oh, did you see that flick shot? In a single frame. Because that's how fast the frame rate is. Gotta save this. <laughs> I was just about to finish uh, pretty soon because it's, it's getting on a little late and I'm starving. Um, but we've very nearly finished this chapter, I believe, so we should uh, just hoover up these last few bits. Yeah, I passed uh, the 52, uh, the 50 follower mark today, Elliot. Can you believe? Uh, Sperry Art uh, raided me with like 27 people. And at least like six of them stayed. It was great. Oh, is it not following me? Hmm. Oh, you big dumb fuck.
Oh good, almost time for on a rail, my super favorite part of Half-Life. No, that's rubbish. That's also rubbish. Ah, uh, come on. One of your scientist pals said to give you a message. You're supposed to take this old rail system up to some kind of satellite delivery rocket. I don't know where it is exactly, and the old guy was so worried about getting out of here alive, he didn't tell me. Main thing is, the military aborted the launch. So when you do find the rocket, you'll have to get up to the control room and launch it yourself. He said something about a Lambda team needing the satellite in orbit if they were ever going to clean up this mess. Okay then, and that seems like a good place to stop. <laughs> Oh, thanks for watching, everyone that stuck around, and everyone who also, you know, is already gone. Thanks to them too. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for watching as well, Dom. Nice to have you. Yeah. Right, I need to set up a raid. Let me just check who is on. Ah, there's a guy uh, who's likes playing the Resident Evil games. He's always a good laugh to watch. Um, he's called uh, Light KV FPS. <laughs> I think he's uh, trans put me onto him. So I'm going to see if I can do this correctly. Thanks for watching everyone, I'm going to send you over now. Say, uh, say Raid and stuff in the chat and be nice, he's great. <laughs>